good evening students welcome once again to another class of online today i'm going to take class 7 english first paper the book is english for today unit 6 lesson 11 the last lesson for the syllabus the selfish giant part 4 page 67 and 68 boys please open your book page 67 at the beginning there are a couple of keywords as usual first i'm going to give you the keywords and the meanings please open your books page I hope you have opened your books by now. So I'm going to start to give you the keywords and the meaning. The first keyword is frightened. feeling fear frighten mane bhoy pawa feeling fear the second word stretch out the meaning is reach out Stretch out. Our heart, in this way, the cow can hold it. She takes a stretch out. Pull it. Reach out. The next one is knock down. meaning the act of falling to the ground after being hit knocked down jore aghat korar por kono kichu pore jao knocked down the act of falling to the ground after being hit the last word uh fling fling to throw something with force jor purbok ba ball proyog kore kono kichu chure mara 
fling to throw. I'm reading out the words and the meaning. Once again, boys, please take it down. Number one, frightened, feeling fear. Number two, stretch out, reach out. Number three, knock down, the act of falling to the ground after being hit. Okay, tomorrow, I'm going to knock down the act of falling to the ground after being hit. Number four, fling, to throw something with force. To throw something with force. Take it down, I'll give you about a minute more, then I'll go to the text. Okay, I'm going to read the text, the final part of The Selfish Giant. The giant felt sorry as he looked out. How selfish I have been, he said to himself. Now I know why the spring would not come here. So he quickly went out into the garden. But when the children saw him, they were so frightened that they all ran away. And the garden became winter again. Only the little boy did not run, for his eyes were so dull of tears that he did not see the giant coming. The giant quietly came behind him, took him gently in his hands and put him up into the tree. And the tree at once broke into blossom and the birds came and sang on it. The little boy stretched out his two arms, flung them round the giant's neck and kissed him. The other children saw this. They saw that the giant was not wicked any longer. So they came back running back and with them came the spring. It's your garden now little children said the giant. Then he took a huge axe and knocked the wall down and the people passing by found the giant playing with the children in the most beautiful garden in the country. আমরা গার্ডেন জায়েন্ট সম্পর্কে যা পড়েছি খুব সাধারণভাবে একটু বলে দিচ্ছি খুব সেলফিশ ছিল সে অনেক দিন বাইরে ছিল ছেলেরা ছেলেমেয়েরা তার বাগানে খেলতো একদিন সে এটা দেখে একটা বিশাল দেয়াল তুলে দিয়েছিল এবং বলেছিল যে ফ্রেস পাসেস আর নট অ্যালাউড সামথিং লাইক ফ্রেস পাসেস উইল বি পানিশড বলেছিল বাচ্চারা ওখানে আসা বন্ধ করে দেওয়ার পর বাগানটা সবসময় উইন্টারে ছিল সবসময় শীত ছিল ডেড জয় এগুলো আমি বুঝিয়েছি পরে হঠাৎ একদিন এর আগের চ্যাপ্টারে জায়েন্ট মিষ্টি মধুর পাখির গানের আওয়াজ শুনতে পেল এবং সে দেখতে পেল যে তার বাগানে উইন্টার আর নেই স্প্রিং চলে এসেছে এইসব দেখে এই চ্যাপ্টারে সে তার সেল তার স্বার্থপরতা সে যে কীরকম স্বার্থপর সেটা সে বুঝতে পারল এই যে প্রথমেই বলা যাচ্ছে দ্য জায়েন্ট ফেল সরি হাউ সেলফিশ আই হ্যাভ বেন সে নিজের স্বার্থপরতা দেখে সে বুঝতে পারলো যে সে আসলে খুবই স্বার্থপর এবং সে উপলব্ধি করতে পারলো যে এই কারণেই তার বাগান সবসময় শীত বা উইন্টার থাকে সো হি ব্যান কুইকলি আউট ইন টু দ্য গার্ডেন এই কারণে সে খুব তাড়াহুড়ো করে বাগানে চলে গেল কিন্তু বাচ্চারা মনে করেছিল কারণ আবার তাদেরকে তেড়ে আসছে তাদের দিকে তারা ভয়ে চলে পালিয়ে গেল এবং সঙ্গে সঙ্গে গার্ডেনটা আবার উইন্টার উইন্টারে ভরে গেল শুধু ওই একটি ছেলে সে যেতে পারেনি কারণ সে এত তার চোখে এত জল ছিল যে সে জায়েন্টকে দেখতেই পারেনি জায়েন্ট আস্তে আস্তে করে তার পিছনে গিয়ে তাকে তুলে গাছের উপর বসালো এবং গাছের উপর বসানোর পর পর দ্য ট্রি বার্স্ট ইন টু দ্য লাইন কন্ট ওয়ান্স দ্য 
the tree broke into blossom. Shongo Shonga got a full Utegalo. The Ujaka take a winter cholegal. Unano Batara, Jokon Deklu, the giant Agermoto Dustonoi, Taro Shobai Chutisha, Bagane, Ashlo, and Bagan take a winter jinx to Akavari Cholegal. Among Tokun Piki, Jokoni, the Ebon Tokuni giant Oder Kebulu, that it's your garden now, little children, Akon Bagan Tatumade. এবং এই পর থেকে যখনই আশেপাশে মানুষ জন উপাস দিয়ে যাওয়া আশা করত তারা সব সময় দেখত যে জায়েন্ট বাচ্চাদের সাথে তার বাগানে খেলছে এবং ওই দৃশ্য দেখে ওদের মনে হলো দ্যাট ইট ওয়াজ দ্য মোস্ট বিউটিফুল গার্ডেন ইন দ্য কান্ট্রি দেশের সবচেয়ে সুন্দর বাগান ওকে নাও আই উইল রিড দ্য क्वेश्चंस এন্ড উইল ট্রাই টু সলভ দ্য আনসারস আই উইল গিভ ইউ আইডিয়াস দ্য রেস্ট ইজ আপ টু ইউ ফার্স্ট क्वेश्चन ওয়াই ডিড দ্য জায়েন্ট ফিল সরি জায়েন্ট কেন I explained it. He felt sorry for his what? Selfishness. I'll write just the answers. Giant felt sorry as he realized that he had been very selfish. Question number two. When did the garden become winter again? As the giant ran into the garden, winter As the giant went quickly into the garden, the children got frightened and ran away, and the garden became winter again. Copy these answers if you need, or if you have your own ideas, you can write. This is just a suggestion. Copy it. I'm giving you a little time. I'll have to wipe the board and start off with the other question answers. I hope this part is done, so I'm <coughs> Wiping this part out. So 
soul number three. Why didn't the little boy run away? Choto bachcha ta keno chute palo no na? Because he did not see the giant as he was so full of tears. Thik na? The little boy did not run away for his eyes were full of tears and he did not see the giant coming. Question 4. <clears throat> what happened when the giant put the little boy up to the tree? When the giant put the little boy up into the tree, at once the tree broke into blossoms and the birds came and sang on it. Okay, my hidden spells here. Question number five. 
why did the other children think that the giant was no longer wicked? Why? Can you say that the giant is wicked? Because the giant helped the little boy put him up on the tree. Seeing the giant helping the little boy, the children understood that he was no longer wicked. Question number six. What happened when the children came back into the garden? When the children came back into the garden, the spring, spring it a season. On the color spring no it a season. Spring came along with them. Okay, when the garden, when the children came back into the garden, the spring came along with them. The last question. Why was the giant's garden the most beautiful garden in the country? Okay, this, I think you try to do it by yourself. Why was the garden, uh, the giant's garden, the most beautiful garden in the country? Can you uh, try? Well, I've already read it before. It was the most beautiful garden in the country because whenever people pass the garden, they always saw the giant playing with the children. Okay, now, uh, Section C, there is a fill in the blanks, the words are there, try to do it by yourself, though I am reading out, just giving you some ideas how you might fill in the blanks. It's written, fill in the blanks with the right form of verbs, given in the bracket, the right form of verbs, 
Okay? So if the tense is in the past, you have to change your verb to the past tense. Okay? Okay, I'm reading it out. First, I'll give you the words that are there. Fling, smile, sit, stretch out, frighten and feel sorry. Okay, yesterday I met a six foot man in the lift of our office. I was a little dash. I was a little frightened. F-R-I-G-H-T-E-N-E-D. I was a little frightened. But he stretched out. The word is stretch out. We'll make it in the past. Stretched out. S-T-R-E-T-C-H-E-D. Stretched O-U-T out. Stretched out a hand and said hello. I too. The same word stretched out mine and we shook hands. Then he dash and went to then he smiled and went towards the manager's office. Flung yeah, the word is fling, it will be flung. F L U N G. Flung open the door and and sat S A T sat on the manager's chair. He was our new manager. I went inside and said, Forgive me, sir. I didn't know. I really feel sorry. This will not be felt because this is an inverted comma, so it will be the tense. Feel sorry. Okay? I hope you've got it. This is the last lesson for the half yearly examination syllabus of English for today. We'll have another class coming up where I will read and I'll give you word meanings and questions of radiant wave. So be in touch and take care of yourselves. Thank you. Okay, you got a minute to pick this up. Please do it.